Good morning, Bowen. This is Nick from Pressman Auto. I'm going to do a video walkthrough of our 2022 Ford F-150. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk all the way around the vehicle. We're going to check for any dents, scratches, any blemishes on the outside. Then we're going to go inside, go over some of the features, make sure everything's working properly. And then finally, we'll pop the hood so we can evaluate a little bit in the engine bay. So first thing to note is that it rained here. So <laughs> we are going to have that for the purposes of this video, but that's okay. If there are any scratches or anything worth noting, I'll be sure to stop and zoom in and make sure you get a good visual. So the front grille up here, normally you'd see a little bit of rock chips or something up here, but I'm really not seeing much. It obviously needs a bath, but <laughs> in terms of damage and stuff, it looks pretty solid. So let's keep going around to see if there's anything that we can find. So first off, the tires on here are, they look brand new. You have loads of life left in those, so that's awesome. A little bit of a tight fit but not seeing anything on this side so that's good Let's see. oh no that came off never mind let's keep going around All right, well, to be completely honest, um, I give it a 10 out of 10. I didn't see a single thing on the exterior that looks like it needs any kind of repairs or any problems at all. No dents, no scratches, nothing. So let's hop inside, go over some features, make sure everything's working. <clears throat> all right. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to turn the vehicle on, and when I do, I'm gonna leave the camera up here on the dash, so if there's any warning lights or whatever, anything weird popping up, you'll be the first to know. So let's check it out. Awesome. So we got one warning light up right now, which is the no seatbelt light, which is correct. I'm not wearing a seatbelt. Turn that off go so let's see if we can cycle through a couple things real quick if I can figure out how there we go driving go coach you coach perfect okay so everything up there looks super solid um, as far as the features go we won't go over everything but just as a brief overview here's a quick look at a couple of things on the cruise control a couple other driving features <clears throat> some more stuff down here for your cameras Over on this side is where you'll have you having your four-wheel drive. Change the modes and move all that around. Make sure the audio is working. Nice. And we already know the AC is working, so that's great. Perfect, perfect. We're also going to have your navigation system. You connect your phone. You have a bunch of options for other apps you can get. So that's cool. And then you can toggle a couple other features up here on the screen. So that's pretty fun. And then of course your owner's manual. So they're doing a lot of those more digitally. I don't know, it might still have one. No, so they're doing a lot of more digital owner's manuals nowadays. Then up top, you'll have a couple more controls up here. Click the camera one. And it'll show you the lady that's walking out front over there. So that's cool. So you have pretty much every bell and every whistle there is to be had. Um, you got your sunroof, moonroof, which I, it, to be totally honest, it's not the biggest feature. It doesn't even really matter all that much, but I love sunroofs. They're just, they're just fun. I, I played as them as a kid and it, I don't know, ever since I just really, really like them. So that's super cool. So we can move that. I won't do the whole thing because it'll take a minute. Or you can move that back. So, you have a couple other things. You got your little space in here. You got some plugins, um, pretty basic stuff. 
as far as the interior goes, it is in phenomenal condition. So that is just everything that I want to hear. So for the sake of time, we'll probably call it there. Um, let's pop the hood and check out a little bit in the engine bay. And then <clears throat> that'll be good for our video. I don't know how mechanically inclined you are or aren't, but in either case, you should always look under the hood of any vehicle you're looking to buy. The reason being, even if you don't know enough from a bolt, you do know what neglect looks like. So if there's like acid buildup around the battery, there's rust all in the metal pieces in there, it's, it's probably a good sign you should ask some more questions. Um, that being said, this looks brand new, probably because it is. It's a, tw it's a 2022, so. Not a big surprise. That being said, it's still wise. If you are mechanically inclined, then we can go into more details, but for the purposes of this video, we'll keep things pretty user friendly. Um, suffice to say, when you pop the hood of an engine bay, this is exactly what you wanna see. This looks awesome. So if you have any more questions or there's anything more specific that you do wanna see, don't hesitate to reach out. I'm happy to show you anything on here. But for now, this is your new F-150.